Hello, BAA. It's Miss Swayze, one of your health and wellness counselors. I am today going to be walking you through a hand tracing exercise. Uh, this is a skill that you can use anytime, um, anywhere, really, that helps you connect to your breath, that helps maybe pause a busy moment or quiet um, lots of thoughts in your head, um, calm emotional experiences that you might be having that might be distracting or distressing. Um, so I'll walk us through and I hope this is something that um, you find helpful. All right, so whenever I start these, I get into a position where I'm really comfortable. I'd recommend you all do the same. Um, a seated position with your feet on the floor is often a really good way to start. I always have to kind of like move my body a little bit just to get into you know, my body in a way that I feel like I can focus on doing this kind of exercise for myself. So again, I encourage you all to take whatever time and movement you need um, to make it happen for yourself. Once you're in a comfortable position, I'd like you to take out one of your hands and just, you can hold it in front of your face if you wanted to put it on your lap or put it in front of you, um, wherever you'd like, wherever it's easy for you to trace. Um, with your other hand. So I'm gonna hold mine up in front of me for you all to be able to see. And um, what I'm gonna do is just with one finger, trace my whole hand up and down, finger by finger, and breathe along the way. And I'll guide us through how um, to breathe along the way for this exercise. All right, so here we go. Um, sometimes people like to close their eyes for these. This one, if you'd like to, feel welcome to. Um, I often encourage people to sort of just watch your finger along the way and pay attention, just to try try pay attention to nothing else other than just what you're doing with your finger in your hand, um, your breath, and if any other kind of distraction comes in your way or thoughts come up, just try to you know acknowledge it and then just do your best to refocus on um, the sensations of your hand going up and down along your um, other hand, your finger going up and down along your hands. And, and your breath. Okay, so as we start, we're gonna start at the base of our wrist below our pinky, and we're gonna travel up towards the top of our pinky with a breath in. Um, try to pull the breath in for, through your nose. Try to make sure you're breathing kind of from, from your belly when you do this. We're gonna breathe in our nose and out of our mouth. I'll guide us through one pace to do this. You can choose your own pace. Um, that fits for your own breath if that's better. But here we go. So count of three, we're gonna breathe in through our nose. One, two, three, and through our nose as we go up, along, towards our pinky. And breathe out through our mouth as we go down our pinky. And through our nose as we go up, our ring finger. Breathe out as we go down. And through our nose as we go up our middle finger. Breathe out as we go down. And through our nose as we go up. Breathe out as we go down. And now back up our thumb as we breathe in through our nose. And down as we breathe out. Go up, backwards now, up towards the top of our thumb as we breathe in through our nose. Breathe out through our mouth as we go down. In through our nose as we go up. Focusing on how our finger feels against the other finger. Breathe out as we go down. And how our breath feels in our body. Breathe up. Breathe out, down. In through our nose as we go up. Out as we go down. Last one, we're gonna breathe in through our nose one last time. And out as we go down. Okay, I hope that was helpful for you. Um, and there's your hand tracing exercise for the day. Thank you, see you around.